Hello, welcome to Ekideo, we are with Twin Civil and Structural Engineer. My name is Justice Mwaka and I am your instructor. Today, I will be showing you a pavilion design that was done on the software Prota 2024. So basically, this is a pavilion design and this is actually our first design that we did using the latest version of what Prota Structure and the version of what 2024. I know that. So um, this is the actual um, first design that we have done using this latest version of Protas 24. I know that. So you can see the design um, interface here. I know that. Yeah. So basically, uh, I have not come to teach you this pavilion design for today, but maybe later I can be able to teach you that later. But I've come today to show you the new things that you are meant to expect on this new version of Prota 2024 and uh, because many people have been asking if they are tends to upgrade or and all that okay but basically it is good to upgrade whenever a software um, brings up a new version okay okay but i'll be showing you some changes now which you might likely be expecting to see and all that okay now, one of the changes uh, or the changes that you might likely um, expect on this new version or that is not the same with the older version is that one is the speed during modeling. Knowing that in 2022, which is the previous version, there are some lagging when you want to model and all that. Okay. So if I come back now to the model interface here, for uh, for example, if I now come now to modeling here, I know that. If I want to model, uh, let me see, let me just go to story one. If I if now want to model um, something, let me just say a wall now. Let me, let me just say a wall. Yeah, you can see that in 2022, right? After clicking on this, I know that it takes time for this dialog box for this input property to appear and all that okay but this time around those things have all gone and also if you want to insert a beam you can see that by the time you put in your first beam it takes time to insert but in this new version those things too has gone then also in 24 version here you know before if you model a project in 2021 you cannot open it in 2022 but in this new version, you can be able to open um, any version of Prota structure in this 2024. Okay, that's one of the major things that you have um, that they have done. Okay, to be able to interface or open your previous projects, which you have done for other versions. Okay, so I have tried it for 2018, 2021, and, and 2022. It was able to open the previous um, works which I did in other versions okay that's one of the things they have done so the other thing again that you might experience here is the foundation for example with this latest version of 2012 um, um, this um, um, you can be able to design more than one foundation on a particular um, project or design or building for example you can combine a raw foundation combine a strip foundation and combine a path foundation and design all of them at once whereas it wasn't the same it was not the same thing as of previous before in 22 version if you mean to design three type for foundation you have to do savers to save um like the project as a different file name for for example in a project i want to design two or i want to use two type of foundation maybe basically because maybe one level is higher and the other level of the ground is lower okay so the place that is lower let me say around the basement side i want to use what a matte foundation and the other place that is higher in slope i can choose to use a strip foundation or a path foundation so in previous version of 22 you will not be able to design those two foundation at at a go but in this new version of um, Protoss 24, you can be able to design the two of them as a go. Okay. Also, in the previous version, you can be able to model 
a lift bit, all right, and design as a goal. But in this new version, you can be able to model a lift bit and design as a goal. Yeah, my listening is lagging here because I have something that is running on my system currently. There, you can, you can see that it is it is lagging. Okay, so again. There is also um, new things here. For example, when you come, when you click on this steel uh, interview, you know that before what we have here was what was um, column, and here was beam. All right, like I said, that here has changed to what frame. That's because they have added a composite uh, members. Okay, and all that. So you can see that um, we now have steel beam here. We now have um, this pull lines and and and, and all that. Then we also have this pole line here too, and, and, and all that. So, and you can, you can also see that they have composite what slab, okay? So we have been trying to exploit this um, new version of the software. For the for the meantime, it's very very good. Is I think is better than the other versions, and, 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 and all that. If you can if you can afford it, it is good to, for you guys to upgrade, and all that. But, but if you can too for now, you can begin to use your older versions, which is still okay. I know that as long as it is working well, it is still okay. And that then also, yeah, we are still trying to exploit this. Okay, because this is our actual first design that we have done currently on this um, software. I know that this is the first design we have done so far. Okay, so we are still trying to exploit this software and all that. Yeah, I will we'll be doing um, this pavilion design on our master class. Yeah, because we are trying to launch master class by 15th of this month. So by 15th of this month, you will be seeing a master class. For those that have paid subscription with Ekidel, you will be able to see our master class and all that. Now, for, for, for those of you that, that don't have um, subscription with Ekidel by the 15th of this month you will be seeing a join button on our on our channel here and on that join button if you click on that join button you will be able to see our master class our advice to join the master class to uh, be, for you to be able to um, be advanced on the design of structures okay yeah then also we will also be introducing other softwares into Ekidel and all that although that's why that we love this software, Photo Structure, and all that. We will still introduce other softwares into Ekidel by the end of this month. But by 15th of this month, you will be seeing most of our videos on our Ekidel Masterclass, okay? And all that. So basically, um, this version of Photo 24 is basically a good one. Yeah, it's basically a good one. Yeah, for the... For the uh, like like I said again, we are still exploring the soft, the the changes that they have made and all that. Yeah, they they did extensive work on on um on foundation, okay. And they have also added American code visibly. Now, if you, for example, if I want to um open a project now, let me say create a new project now. For example, you can see now that it, it, they have added additional codes. Before the last code here was just um you will code um, uk but now you can see that they have american code added that's because they have gotten visibility in what in the american um, region that's in united states and all that and the countries that that are using what um american code that aci code. okay that's fine so you can see that they have added other codes and also they also have imperial because um us uses two um two uh method of what measurement imperial and what uh, metric so they, they also have that too you can see that okay so you can see that they have also added other codes okay which they have also modified other codes too on which already was existing okay that's fine so I'll cancel this now okay so one of the things actually that they have done on this is that one is for us to be able to open our previous work that we did on other versions on the current version which is very very nice then two for the advancement on the foundation which they have done you can be able to combine two different foundation and design as a go that's fine and then other features to control lagging to control and delay in loading and other stuff okay that's fine and that's also you can you can be able to see that they also have steel members new steel members 
and then flexibility in modeling, okay? Although we are still exploring the software and all that, but as we use it and all that, you'll be seeing most um, advanced changes and what you can do using this new version of what? Prota 2024, okay? That's fine. So thank you so much and God bless you. Ekide loves you and we love you. Then bye for now. Bye then. Be before you go, if you find our channel very, very useful, I would advise that you can share our videos or our channel link to your friends and colleagues. If you're working, share with your colleagues. If you are a student, share on your um, WhatsApp group chat or share with your friends and all that so they can be able to know and then um, know what's happening on Ekidel and also gain the knowledge of what design of structures, okay? That's fine. And then if you want to advance more on your design and all that, I would advise you enroll for Ekidel mentorship training as currently it is opened for this batch and all that. So Ekidel mentorship class is open currently for the new batches and all that. So I would advise you can enroll for that if you want to advance and all that. Then also, we also have flexible payment plan where you can pay up to three times and all that before you can complete your payment. That's fine. While your training is um, going on, you begin to make your payments and the body, but you must make your first payment installment. Then you continue, then begin your pay, your, your training. Then, then along the line, you cannot continue making your payments till you complete it. Okay, that's fine. So, thank you so much and God bless you. Equity loves you and will love you. Then, bye for now. Bye then.